H3N2 is a type of influenza A virus that can cause seasonal flu outbreaks in humans. It is named after two proteins on its surface, hemagglutinin, H, and neuraminidase, N, that help the virus attach to host cells and escape from infected cells. The first known case of H3N2 was reported in Hong Kong in 1968, and it quickly spread to other parts of the world. It is now responsible for a significant portion of seasonal flu cases each year and can cause severe illness, particularly in vulnerable populations such as the elderly, young children, and people with underlying health conditions. The flu is a contagious respiratory illness caused by viruses that infect the nose, throat, and lungs. The flu can cause a wide range of symptoms, including fever, cough, sore throat, body aches, headache, chills, and fatigue. In some cases, the flu can lead to complications such as pneumonia, bronchitis, and sinus infections, which can be serious or even life-threatening. There are three main types of influenza viruses, A, B, and C. Influenza viruses can be further classified into subtypes based on their hemagglutinin, H, and neuraminidase, N, proteins. There are currently 18 known H subtypes and 11 known N subtypes, and different combinations of these proteins can result in different subtypes of influenza A viruses. H3N2 is different from other strains of the flu virus in several ways. One of the most significant differences is its ability to mutate rapidly, which can lead to the emergence of new strains that are not covered by existing vaccines or that are more virulent and can cause more severe disease. This is why it is important for public health officials to monitor flu activity and update vaccines as needed to provide the best protection against circulating strains. Another way that H3N2 differs from other strains of the flu virus is in its epidemiology, or how it spreads and affects populations. H3N2 tends to cause more severe illness than other flu strains, particularly in the elderly, young children, and people with underlying health conditions. This is because H3N2 can cause more inflammation in the body, which can lead to complications such as pneumonia, bronchitis, and sinus infections. In addition, H3N2 can be more contagious than other strains of the flu virus, meaning that it can spread more easily from person to person. This can lead to more widespread outbreaks and higher numbers of cases and hospitalizations. The flu virus is primarily spread through droplets when an infected person talks, coughs, or sneezes. These droplets can land on surfaces or be inhaled by other people nearby, leading to infection. The flu virus can also be spread by touching a surface contaminated with the virus and then touching one's mouth, nose, or eyes. H3N2 is a type of influenza A virus.